Once in South Africa... I'm sorry, but do you know why I like to live in my own house? What? Oh. Mm. I like to live in my own house because I can make my own schedule. I can do everything whenever I want. I, I wake up at 7 a.m., I have breakfast at 8, lunch at 3, dinner at 7, and I go to sleep by 10 p.m., and I have a fresh mind every morning. <laughs> <laughs> this is very good to have fresh mind. Mm. Yeah, when I was in the army, I knew someone. It was a surgeon uh, from the Marine Corps. So, once in South Africa, that surgeon, his name was Pearson. Yes, James Pearson. Oh, 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 listen to me. Oh, I have a sore throat. Oh, oh. Damn it, I've been home today because of my friend. His son is in a terrible condition with swine flu. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. This. Disease is very contagious and dangerous. I'm afraid that I could affect you, Mr. Neverleavesky. <laughs> this flu is very dangerous and could be lethal. <laughs> <laughs> lethal? For me? <laughs> when we were deployed to Argentina, I was in the hospital full of people infected with typhus and anthrax, and I never was infected because. I am as strong as Boo. <laughs> In my division was Captain Chisson. So I'm sorry for the interruption, but when do you usually go to sleep? Mm. You know, sometimes at 2 a.m., 3 a.m., it depends, my friend. For example, today I slept well till 2 p.m., so I'm not going to go to sleep early, especially if I have good company to chat with. <laughs> yeah. When I was in the army, we wouldn't go to sleep for days, weeks sometimes. Yeah. So, once in South Africa... I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I go to bed every night at 10 p.m. It's good for the health. Yes, it's good for the health. So, once in South China... In South Africa. Yeah, sorry, sorry. South Africa. <laughs> So, once in South Africa... Oh, oh. oh this always happens. First I'll vomit, and then I'll have a paroxysm, and then I'll finish with wingdings, and then I'll lose consciousness. And it always happens at nighttime. Around 10 p.m. Uh, oh, I'll just start to suddenly attack people. Just throw things at my roommates. If I have a knife, I'll throw it. Oh my god. I'll be getting soon. The world is so interesting. So many diseases. Tell me more about them. By the way, Colonel, would you like me to read you my novel? I wrote it recently while well, in college, I wrote it. Would you like to hear it? I would love to. Oh. Okay, listen and enjoy. In a big house in Malibu, where Mr. Fix lived for a long time, suddenly two zombies appear. Darling, you should know what I want. You are my knight, says Emily to Zombie. I want you to embrace your hands around me and kiss and kiss me. And I want you to love, love, love. I'm so tired. Oh, if you're tired, just forget about it. We'll continue tomorrow. <laughs> so. Once in South Africa, <sighs> me and my dear friend Captain Tyson. Oh, 
Colonel. Yes. It's so great that you came to my house today. No problem, my friend. Yeah, I have a question. Just ask anything. Uh, this month I have a lot of expenses and I am looking to borrow some money from someone, maybe two or three hundred dollars. I have to go. Oh, but where do you have to go now? I know Say you're hello to time. your wife. I have to go. Goodbye. Oh, but you, you should come. <laughs>